goes beyond science. A Wisconsin company developed a device that helps blind people see. And how it delivers information to the brain is amazing. Courtney Garris joins us to explain how BrainPort works. It's new at 10. Courtney. Carol and Charles, it's helping blind people see with their tongues. It turns out the brain doesn't care how it gets visual information. As one Madison man who's been blind since birth shows us, you don't really need your eyes to see. We're going to make a left hand turn into the grass. Kevin Jones lost his sight as an infant after being born three months premature. These are the glasses with the camera in them. Now he's learning to see in a different way. It helps me understand things that were not possible before at all. Kevin's been using the BrainPort device for a year now and experiencing some pretty amazing things. The thing that was on a whole different level for me was watching a lunar eclipse. It just started getting smaller and smaller. It was so cool. And he saw all of that through his tongue. The brain is not hardwired, so you don't have to go, for instance, from the eye through the um, optic nerve to the brain. Bob Beckman is the CEO of WeCap, the Middleton, Wisconsin company that developed the BrainPort technology. The BrainPort is more like learning a new language than it is like learning to see. We had Kevin walk down the sidewalk to show us how it works. The device in his mouth is connected to the video camera on his glasses. Here's what the camera sees. That visual data is sent to Kevin's tongue, which then delivers it to his brain. Now look at the image on the right. That's what Kevin sees. It takes training, it takes time, and even Kevin is still learning to uh, use the device. BrainPort draws a picture on Kevin's tongue and he has to figure out what that is. And once you do, BrainPort opens up a whole new world. In this video produced by WeCab, Kevin is throwing darts at a target, putting a golf ball. He's even able to stop a rolling ball. But the best part for Kevin, using this tool to get through daily life. You can see sidewalks, you can see crosswalk lines, which is great for really busy or wide streets. And what's been fun for Kevin, building a visual understanding of the world. He's figured out how to pick up a soccer ball. I used to miss all the time when I try to just see the ball and then aim for it. So he started using his hand as a marker. I was imposing my hand over the top of the ball. Were you able to see your hand then? Yes. The, the brain port? Yeah. And then when it lined up, then I knew I could reach for it. And then there are the things explained to him over the years that Kevin never really understood. Like fireworks, something he's been able to see for the first time. I can see that some are really bright, some are not as bright. Nothing is in color, but Kevin is still soaking up his new view of the world. So Kevin was part of the clinical trials for BrainPort, which has been used in Europe since 2013. The FDA just approved it. So right now, Kevin is the only American with this device. This is incredible. It really is. So how much does this cost, Courtney? It's expensive right now. It's $10,000. But the hope is private insurance, Medicare, even the VA is going to help cover some of that cost. WeCab is actually getting funding from the U.S. Army to help blinded soldiers. So for more information on BrainPort, go to our website, tmj 4 yeah. Dot com. It was so intriguing to see how it works. Wow. You can see the application on this on so many uh, different levels. But it's something you have to learn. That's yeah. what makes it interesting. Cool. Okay, thank you, Courtney.